Yeah, welcome friends and uh, we have already completed the 20 sessions of our international indenting business and now uh, this is time for conclusion or the summary uh, how how this uh, uh, course has been completed uh, what we discussed in the first session that what we will cover and the entire thing we have uh, covered now and the last uh, session of uh, conclusion or summary so we have started with why we are proposing this business why indenting because no risk and no investment kind of business uh, immense business potential and benefits by sitting at home, so whole, so small office, home office business and you can do in any country, anywhere, you can choose any product of your liking or a special product or a new product or a futuristic product and you can embark upon the business locally, like local indenting or maybe it doing uh, into, uh, you know, like exports, so it is a reverse indenting and then doing uh, you know third country to third country which is international indenting so uh, indenting overseas sourcing local to local domestic indenting and then reverse indenting that is export indenting and also the international indenting so we are not leaving any space or any business uh, available on the earth you know when we they will, they will do uh, or business will exist uh, on the sea or maybe business will exist on the another planet, we can add that extended definition also. So this business is uh, nothing but uh, getting the matchmaking of the supplier and customer. You have a customer also and you have a supplier also and from surplus the product moves into uh, the scarcity or the required product uh, you know, country. So this is how the indenting flows goes on and uh, the indenter those who are the mediators like us or you uh, they will be getting the consideration uh, into the us dollar or uh, euro or any hard currencies for doing this job of facilitating the supplier to sell their products into your home country or other countries or reverse indenting or international indenting or local indenting right so we have <clears throat> seen these basics and then we have seen that why import happens or why export happens you know, there are common reasons that uh, natural, natural calamities uh, like pandemic situation or feminine or a typhoon also attracts, though it is not a good thing to do business because of these reasons. But this is what is the, you know, the basic uh, uh, need uh, of the product suddenly uh, getting uh, to revamp or to uh, attain this, uh, you know, eventuality. And then the business happens due to there is an abundant source of supply somewhere and there is a scarce source of uh, supply in another country or another continent. <clears throat> then the business happens because there are unions like European unions or NAFTA association or SARC association or maybe uh, you know Asiana or uh, African countries association, Middle East association and Jibka and Jabka and so many other uh, you know associations they are working uh, for various regions and uh, uh, you know kind of a continents. So what happens? So these are uh, creating uh, the business happening uh, within the countries uh, uh, import and export also and locally billions of dollar of business is also happening. So that is also you can do the matchmaking and you can earn the money as an indenter. <clears throat> so uh, what uh, products uh, the business happens you have to see around what are the import products you see in your home country and what are the exports going from your own country right uh, so these basics we covered in the you know kind of a first point of or uh, first session uh, uh, very first sessions and so that we get a basics clear and then we go for choosing the 25 products and making the kitty uh, how different five different things uh, we try to uh, segments or uh, categories we try to generate the product minimum 25 products you can go for even 100 products when i started i started with 150 products and i could do a business in 100 products so i don't want to burden you so i'm saying that you choose 25 products as per the given uh, you know coaching and accordingly then you shortlist five products and try to make the business uh, uh, within say three months time to six months time to maximum one year time because if you are doing something simultaneously, then uh, you are doing a job or you are doing some other business, existing business, <coughs> then maybe you can do, uh, you know, along with that. So we are not asking you to leave that business, but to add upon the business, to add the revenue by getting into new multiple products 
and that will create the revenue. Let's say every year if you embark upon five products, then within the five years you will have a 25 product and within 10 years you can target for the at least 50 products, if not 100 products. <clears throat> if you have a say 50 kitty or 50 or 100 products by the 10th year, at least 10 or 15 or 20 products are working. So you get a huge revenue by this uh, you know module what we have suggested. And then by putting the money into this business after you know doing multiple transactions or hundreds of transactions, then whatever you have earned, suppose you earn a one million dollar, then you can invest uh, because so many people are investing on your advice and they have been doing successful trade. Then ten percent of whatever revenue you earn in terms of you know getting a commission or a consulting fee, you can try and test uh, you know uh, uh, how is the market for you if you are doing the investment and trading. But only ten percent I will suggest. Even if you don't do, this will continue because uh, whatever new products are getting added. Uh, you can do that. But everyone suppose have a <clears throat> dream to do some export or import. So with this earned money, you can uh, probably uh, go on doing the business in the known products only by investing 10% of revenue what you generated with this add-on business. And then this becomes a trading business. So it may be a local trading, it may be a you know import trading, or it may be a export trading or international trading. And then we have seen that how this process will uh, go through the steps involved, uh, you know, like uh, before the deal, during the deal, before the shipment, after the shipment, and after retiring the documents uh, by the buyer, supplier getting payment, and lastly, you get the commission after the supplier gets the money in their account. And all this business, we are saying you will go safe way and you will be not uh, giving any open credit so that uh, you, your supplier is going to get the all money back, uh, whatever the, <coughs> you know, the bill amount and the buyer will get the desired quality and we will get our, uh, you know, uh, what you call your commission or your uh, facilitating uh, overriding commission or a consulting fee, whatever name you are giving in your country and then you account it and you can pay the taxation. Uh, in your home country and this is very simple game. So hardly any compliances, hardly any document you are making. <clears throat> the documents are made either by the supplier like uh, you know uh, issuing the intent or a contract or making the shipping document or making the original document submission and buyer is also making uh, you know accepting the document or accepting the order or maybe they are giving the letter of credit or ma making the payment through their bank channel or direct TT or letter of credit or any kind of uh, you know operations if it is local it will be in uh, whatever denominations of your country are allowed so <clears throat> this will complete with the one client and then uh, one product and then you can multiply simultaneously don't wait that you know this whole transaction goes for one month or three months time so simultaneously you have plenty of customers as we have uh, posted you how many customers you should have so you have a plenty of customer and how you are searched in a very short time and the suppliers uh, to back up, say maybe you have a, you know, a one dozen suppliers or a five suppliers and you, you can uh, go even for the uh, clients in the all application of that product or a limited application as per your target is. So this is what we have seen and you can earn the revenue fantastically and uh, this will be add-on business which can become a main source of business and uh, there is no, uh, you know, kind of uh, indenting business anywhere been promoted uh, actually the way I'm saying because always the import bills in our home country like India is very high compared to the export bill and even if your export bill is very high in your home country but still you require to have imports for certain commodities to depend upon or to adjust or stabilize uh, you know your currency or maybe just to support the WTO IMF and this kind of uh, you know uh, this uh, 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 trade uh, unions uh, or the uh, compliance kind of uh, uh, institutions which are governing and which are making the duties down like WTO, World Trade Organization from you know a level of in India in 1980s uh, it is a 250 percent duty and now it is coming up to 5 to 10 percent. So I think uh, all most of the marks goes to them and also the uh, World Bank and the IMF and other trade uh, you know uh, unions uh, between the uh, countries of like European Union and all that and they also trigger the business and also the arbitrage continuous buying and selling <coughs> and to uh, you know get the best uh, technology product and uh, globalization 
because the world is now connected and the whole norms of business and uh, you know even the this courses we are doing on a, a kind of a, you know online and uh, we, we have been benefiting and a lot of cost is saved in travel and doing all kind of personal uh, bookings and all of course some business or hotels and uh, you know other uh, things have been hampered a little bit but it is only temporary phenomenon because again people will have to physically uh, probably go and uh, materialize the business if you, they want to grow more and more so this is how you know uh, this indenting business is and uh, please take benefit and start wherever you are stuck up uh, we can have a, you know further uh, hand holding or consulting if you require uh, then uh, you have my numbers or we can you can get in touch with us and we can further see how we can help you out thank you so much all the best happy indenting and make more money and get rich richy rich bye bye thank you